Welcome to Warp Curry. I'm Gary Patel. I'm Yogi. And what are we talking about? All right. So you guys got to check these out. So I have these bone conducting headphones on. Um, I met up, I met a friend um, at, at an event and he, he had these things on and I was like, oh, are these, these bone conducting headphones that you're hearing about? A lot of people might know about them. He used them. I, I put on the ones he had. It was a game changer. Like it was, I hate Bluetooth headphones and I'm going to go off on a little bit of a rant, but the, the in-ear headphones are so frustrating because they all hurt your ear and now they have noise canceling ones, which means it has to seal the opening of your ear. And that brings in this fatigue and it's so annoying to wear these headphones at times. So these bone conducting headphones actually sit outside of your ear. I have a pair on right now. Um, and basically I assume bone conduction means it, the sound travels through your bone or through your ear or something. Um, there's also a little speaker where the audio kind of goes in. It's not like people around you could hear anything. It's like the equivalent of someone cranking their headphones. Oh, pretty. Um, it just, yeah, I just no ear fatigue. Go ahead. I just found this while you were talking because it's pretty interesting. I had no idea this thing even existed, but uh, uh, I did Scroll a quick up search a bit of, so people can see it. Did a quick search of your bone conducting concept. Um, it is pretty interesting. So I guess these are what I normally use, which I hate using. So I stopped using headphones pretty much altogether. Um, but this sits outside the ear and the sound travels through the bone now. I don't it's know how like, that works, but it'd be interesting to see how that how, how well does it work? It works like audio wise, you can hear it great. Now, this is not the big over the ear, you know, Beats or Bose headphones that have give you like supreme sound quality. But let me tell you, it is yeah, exactly. Show that picture with the with the ear. It is exactly what you need, hmm. in my opinion, right? So even if I'm listening to light music in the background, it's definitely good enough. Again, it's not high quality sound but it's definitely good enough but the comfort level you feel is just next level you do not mind having them in your ears all day long um it sounds great in fact it sounds great to the people i talk to i'm going to change my mic hopefully this works on the fly and we don't screw up this whole thing hello oh, that's, connect that's connected to your computer right now no now this is connected to these things can you hear me no, it's, go back to the other one. This actually sounds better, I think. Oh, crap. We're just wasting our money on some mics. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go back to the USB mic. Talk. Can you hear me? Yep. I'm They're here. Can you hear different. Me? They're both clear. I don't know which one I prefer more. The other one's a bit louder, but maybe that's some sound that can be adjusted. But to me, that's... And I'm going to... How, how much are those, roughly? Um, these are like 180 ish. So these are, yeah, so that's, it's about the same as other yeah. good quality, uh, headphones, but, uh, I would really yeah. have to try analogy. it just to see. And, and just to save it one side, I'll give you a quick analogy. Back in the days, uh, windshield wipers for cars, they were mechanically driven, right? So the faster you drove, the faster your wipers went and the slower you went, the slower they went. Then they made it electronic and you control the speed. And now they have electronic speed sensitive wipers that actually adjust to the speed. So the headphones has pretty much taken a similar approach. You get these Apple ear pods or the Samsung, whatever headphones, they're noise canceling. So they seal your ear and it cancels all the noise around you. And then it detects if you're talking and it turns on a mic on the outside and it projects it on the inside. And they claim it works better. So you're like in the world and you're around everyone and it's kind of natural. In my opinion, it is not. They all suck. It's terrible. This is literally like you are in the room, and it is perfect. I can, if someone's talking to me right now, I can hear them. I can imagine for you, Kay, you're, you're doing construction, right? You own a company. You're going from site to site. You're on calls. There might be even times where you're helping someone move something or do something or assisting people. If you had this on, you could be on a call, but then you could hear someone around you as well because it's all wide open. It's literally like there's a ceiling speaker in your room that's playing the music. Yeah. If you're listening to music or if you're on a call, but it's all open. It's next level. You definitely got to try it. 
I went from never wearing headphones all day long to kind of wearing these, at least during work hours. Hopefully my brain doesn't get fried from the Bluetooth, but I love these. The, and the nice thing with these is they don't look like you're on the headphones, right? Like I don't like wearing headphones yeah. sometimes, especially when I'm out in public, because then if I feel like I'm, I'm ignoring the person, even though my full intention is to be listening to that person. But when they're in your ear, you know, they're annoying, but then it also feels like you're ignoring the person. And so I like this, like, even though I can tell that you have them on, it doesn't look like you're ignoring because they're not in your ear. Like it's exactly you know, big headphones. I'm, obviously people would feel like you're ignoring them at the gym or anywhere else. This at least, in I fact, feel like I can in talk fact to that somebody. friend, and you know, this guy as well, I hadn't, I haven't seen him in like 10 or 15 years and he had him on and we were all kind of sitting around the table and we were listening and, or sorry, we were talking. And he had these on the whole time and we were talking as if whatever, we're just catching up on old times and all that. And then I was like, oh, are those, those bone conducting headphones. And he's like, yeah. And I was like, how do they sound? He's like, they're on right now. And I literally had a 10, 15 minute conversation with him, not even realizing they were on. He took them on and put it on my head. I could hear music loud and clear and hear them talking. So I didn't even realize that he was listening to music yeah. the entire time he was talking to all of us. It felt so natural. No, definitely something I'm oh. going to try out. So I might order these. Uh, these are sure. these are Shocks Open Run Pro. We'll we'll add the link to it. I'm not promoting these. Uh, I I love these. They're great. They are expensive, but they're great. We'll put a link in our in our thing. But search around, find other bone conducting headphones that work well. Because uh, everyone who I've talked to and everyone who's seen me with these, they asked me to put them on, and they're like, "Send me the link. I want to buy them right now." All right. So it's what he so meant. Much. What he meant is we're not promoting them. I mean, we are promoting them, but they're not promoting us. But the goal is one day for them to promote us. I don't know what the hell you just said or what the difference is, but okay. We need to make money off of this one day. That's what, <laughs> that's, that's what I'm saying. So everybody buy Shocks, if you're listening, you need to send us a sponsorship check. It's basically pretty much what we need. Yeah, there's going to be at least one order by the end of today. <laughs> All right, and if bye. you give us a good deal, we'll push it to two. All right. See you later, guys. Later.